The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Maria. There's the bell, and here we go. The first competitor to pin or make their opponent tap will win this match. A vicious stomp. It's cinched in. He's had enough. This could be it. A vicious stomp. Oh, the punch connects. There's the submission hole. I've seen a lot of superstars tap out of this one. You and me both, partner, and we might be about to see another one right here. What a counter. Victory means absolutely everything to these competitors tonight. That's a real pearl of wisdom. You got any others? Like the superstar who beats their opponent will be the winner? How about you should spend more time calling the match and less time cutting down your broadcast part? Oh, man. A slap like that doesn't tickle. Believe you me. And there's the reversal. There's two things I like about Elijah Burke. The first is his talent for talking trash. I can't argue with that, although I don't think it's his most admirable quality. What's the second thing? The fact that he can back it up in the ring, this guy's pure dynamite between those ropes. You can say that again. He's made quite a name for himself so far in WWE. Oh, the hand connects with the throat. That'll do some damage. There's the cover. One, two. Kicked out just in the nick of time. What an impact from the face buster. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Oh, man. What a crushing blow. A vicious stomp. Uh. 
night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze the fans. And that's a good thing. I don't even like to think about where we'd be if they didn't. Well, we wouldn't be sitting here calling this match, that's for sure. A vicious blow to the opponent. That move will knock the win right out of you. A vicious stomp. Wow, great reversal. The WWE superstars are all superb athletes, but they're also human beings, and there's only so much punishment a human body can take. A sick neck breaker. Submission hold locked in. We may see a tap out right here. Do you submit? What a counter that was! Well, that'll send you to the chiropractor. Elijah Burke had 102 knockouts as a boxer before he came to WWE. 102! And it would have been 103, but after knocking his opponent out, he was disqualified for not going to a neutral corner. He's letting his opponent know what's up. What a devastating maneuver. Great reversal. Here's the pin. One, two. The referee's hand was coming down for a three count. Perfect Russian leg sweep. Don't try this stuff at home. Absolutely not. These are trained WWE superstars. And even they wind up seriously injured sometimes. And there are those educated feet. Nice quick counter there. Talk about educated feet. Vicious jab with the right. Wow, what an STO. This could be three right One, here. Two, three, and that's the match. Sometimes it's just not your night.